Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis clashes with lawmakers at the state capitol over a series of bills designed to hold prosecutors in check. Our members of the House and Senate are considering three separate proposals that would make it easier to remove district attorneys and solicitors general from office. A Fox 5 political reporter Claire Sims joins us now at the live desk. And Claire Willis took issue with the timing of these measures. Yeah, Fonnie Willis says after the 2020 election, minority district attorneys now represent a majority of Georgia. polls. This bill is dangerous. It is dangerous to undo the voters because you don't like someone. Fulton County District Attorney Fonnie Willis tells members of the Senate Judiciary Committee that she is in complete opposition to a bill to create a prosecuting attorney's oversight commission in Georgia. Republican lawmakers in both the House and Senate filed legislation to create a panel with the power to discipline, remove, or forcibly retire district attorneys or solicitors general that they believe are not performing their duties. But Willis says that should be for voters to decide. The voters are my boss, and so we absolutely answer to the voters. Willis says this new push for prosecutorial oversight comes after the... in here and try to make this about racism as absurd and it's offensive and it's a racist statement on its own. State Representative Houston Gaines filed another bill which Willis opposes. It would reduce the percentage of voters needed to recall a DA from 35 to 2. Gaines says he drafted the bill after the DA in his district, Deborah Gonzalez, announced she would not prosecute drug possession for election would be too late. We can't wait for a year or two years or three years if a DA is not doing their job. Representative Gaines says those two oversight commission bills will likely get floor votes sometime next week. At the live desk, Claire Sims, Fox 5 News. All right, Claire, thanks.